this is Raukan playing the Smurl Freedom, still in the last world. Uh, and the uh, argumentable suggested uh, that I go do the left side first, so I'm going to do the left side first. Chasing Patrees, Pytrees, is it a reference to something in the Mario Kingdom that I don't know? Is it me somehow dodging that bomb somehow that kind of probably should have hit me? Well, whatever it is, it's an the scrolling level that's vertical. It also has our little buddies. Oh, well, I don't know if they're buddies, but they are my friends. Can you have a buddy that is not a friend? That is now your question for now. Okay, instead of saying nonsense for three hours, I should probably instead concentrate myself into figuring out where we're going, why we're going, and with whom are we going. All those important questions that we spend a big old chunk of our adolescence trying to figure out. It's always... The, the, the road to figuring out can be somewhat of a mess. Fortunately, people went, went through their adolescence, you know, adults that basically became adults know where you've been through and are willing to kind of like, you know, to, to kind of be climactic, not climactic, but you know, they're willing to be kind of understanding about it. Those who won't be are those who basically never actually did grow up, you know, what we call, what, the, if you're part of the media, they'll just call it Peter Pan syndrome, but uh, let's be honest here, if you're a normal jerk, we'll just call you a man-child, which is basically the exact same thing. Just one of them sounds a bit friendlier, I guess. Friendlier might be, 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 bombs, 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 they explode all over the land. Bombs are not a nice thing to put in your soup unless you don't want to survive your meal. Which, honestly, surviving a meal seems like, like a good attribute to give to a meal, sur survivability. Not something most people think about. Well, other than people who perhaps eat like poisonous uh, perkapoofers and fish like, fish like that. You know, kind of, kind of like, no? Remember when, when, when Clyde, or whatever his name was, had uh, intestinal problems because he ate a globe fish that was perhaps not well cooked? But well, you don't want that to happen, do you? Because that sounds like it'd be very unpleasant. Man, this place, I keep getting attacked from the top, and it's kind of scary, it's kind of here, now I'm outside, and it's all like, whoa, Bob. Those, 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 those blue bricks for a while made me scared. They were the types where you could pick up and fall. However, there's one right at the edge there, too. However, there was one over the land, so in the end, it didn't really... This has a secret exit? How does this has a secret exit? Where is the secret exit in this mess? Huh. Let's look around, I guess. Man, I just have no idea. Is there something here? No. I can't return. Oh, well. Oh, well. Well. <laughs> that explains that. Wait, 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 this continues. Well, kind of. Whoa, okay. <laughs> well, that explains why I can't find anything in the body of the level. It's like, you're the cape to the end! Yay! And you get all the way to the star place. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do these last two levels down there. And uh, let's go with here, Danger Way. The Way of the Danger. Danger Town, Dangerville, Danger Place, Danger Bird. Well, you're just a hunchback, so you don't count. Hey, buddy. And there's a Yoshi in Danger Way, because he's always in the way of danger. Ouch, I'm an idiot. How do you get that? Well, C's enough to get. You just gotta... Ugh! See, that's what you gotta get, the grunt. Always remember the grunt. It's the most important part. And I get back the feather that I lost. Hooray! Knocking guys overboard out of their vehicles for fun and profit in a game ostensibly designed for children. Always a good time, bullet. Whoa, 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 just take a time here and be careful. That seems like a ludicrously dangerous dragon going to get unless you get it from this side. In which case, the ludicrousness kind of fades away. Still not, whoa, kind of dangerous, but you know. I have a business of not being careful, especially when I am astride a meat shield of some kind. And uh, 
And to think that Yoshi could have led me to finish this level early. But that is not something I actually desire. I am interested in this danger. Bullet filled as it may be, spinning around invincibly. And, you know, taking my time and doing stuff and just kind of enjoying the ride. Whoa. Good thing that the cape is, like, totally broken. Because that is the case. It's not, like, it's not the fact that it makes jumps a lot easier, and it's not the fact that it kills so many things. It's the case that it does both, is the problem with the cape. If I were to redesign this engine, I'd probably make the hitting portion of the cape and the floating, jump-abling, flying portion of the cape essentially two separate power-ups. So, uh, War Eagle, you know, dude that is making a potential independent, non-ROM dependent, uh, 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 hacking, well, level designing tool, maybe you should consider this. And here's Bowser Jr.'s boats! He has a bunch of boats! He rides on them and goes toot toot toot! Okay, the music is a bit more serious than that. Bowser Jr., for the people out there who was probably forgotten, was the first boss we fought in this video game. And our first introduction to the fact that this game had extremely impressive bosses, and also bullets, you know, cannons, and you can spin around and knock them out of town if you want to, but you don't have to. If you just want to enjoy the ride, you're allowed to. Let's look for safe places. I can jump over there, but I can just hang around below here. Oh, we got more plasma ball, you know, plasma sphere, you know, plasma propulsion. We're gonna use what constitutes your blood, other than... Oh no, that was unfortunate. Oh no, that was doubly unfortunate. Now the blocks are just floating and kind of ruining the magic. Ah, root. Wow, that... Great... Oh, for a coin. Now I was expecting as such, but you know, that didn't stop me. Then I'm gonna jump in the explosion, because that certainly won't stop me. Well, see, this was all entirely on purpose, so now I, I am not protected by spinning around rapidly. And I have to do Bowser Jr.'s boats, uh, you know, quote-unquote legit. Too legit to inspire. Oh, that's, that's kind of an unfortunate call, calling card there. Well, you know, no, that, that, that doesn't make any sense. There's no way you can... Like, reclaim that sentence, Cow Cow, and make it sound like it was something you said on purpose. It is impossible. Kinda lucky around that explosion. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Oh, uh, explosions are kinda scary. Because, see, when they say goodbye, sometimes, actually, what they do mean is hello. And it can lead to a lot of hilarious confusion. But, uh, you know, if you're not into the whole confusion as punchline, uh, well, there was a period of television that probably left you distraught. And I apologize for that, sincerely and personally, even though I had nothing to do with it. So, hey, last time when I threw a bomb there, I was a cause of my own destruction. That's a new gimmick I've never tried before. Oh, whoops. I just caused my own destruction. That's a gimmick I've never tried before. I can floaty float, 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 though. Pretty nice. I don't think I'm gonna need that. Where am I safe? I guess I'm kind of safe here on what I am assuming is some form of, I don't know, air conditioner. <laughs> Your guess is as good as mine, honestly. They're just these little turbiney things. I wanna bounce on a bullet. Oh man, I just bounced on a bullet. I am the luckiest man in Fresno, California. Even though we are currently in Minnesota, I forget my letters. Don't explode, bomb! My letters! Don't explode, bomb! It's the most important part of a bomb, is to not explode, especially if you're trying to be friendly. The pink bombs are nice bombs, because they don't explode. Instead, they shoot you out of a can, which is a lot safer. You know, it's deadly. Is the slowdown here caused by a saturation of sprites? Or because the generator is made like that? I think we all know the answer. Right, Hop and Goomba? I don't know what you're trying to accomplish there. But you made a little... <laughs> it's General! Big Giant Goomba Guy! Look at that guy! <laughs> He's great. Let me guess. The midpoint was beyond there. This cannot be healthy. What? Oh no! That's right! You're supposed to pick them up. 
You know what? I bet the midpoint was just beyond a little bit there. Let's return back to the scene and and see for ourselves. Ah, uh, there's General Goomba hopping a little bit as he's walking back and forth, flapping his mouth. Snot go in this and check my. Oh, so there's legit no midpoints in this level? Why would you do that? Why? You're weird. Maybe I'm supposed to, like, blow it up with this. Ugh. Ah! Well, why am I murdering myself just to check that out, then? I don't know. Ah! Ah! I'm still surprised by the complete lack of midpoints, though. Uh, I still want to try and... Ah! Uh, yeah, you, you're, you don't really do anything, buddy. What I want to do is kick this... Oh, that block is solid! Well, oh, screw that noise. Now, another thing that caught me off guard is that... Uh, the shell, even though it has a shell graphic, does not behave like a shell. So it's kind of frus well, frustrating would be going a bit far, but... Uh, different enough to be confusing. And it doesn't even slide on the ground normally. Ugh, you shouldn't buy, uh, whoa, unofficial shells like that, uh, Junior Koopa Man. Okay, so now I got a magical stone dad. Or, oh, right, it's need to use the normal jump, absolutely. It's a magical stone dad, otherwise. Wait, are you? Spitting out the hammers from your mouth? That's weird. There's an axe. <laughs> oh. uh. What can I say? I as soon as something unpredictable happens, I just panic. Yay! I blew him up and it didn't do anything. I was hoping it like summon a, a midpoint or something, because you kind of have to go like way ahead of yourself to be able to do it, but. Man, this place is just so ugh, stressful. It's like there's a lot of projectiles and you're not really dealt to deal with projectiles and the shells don't work like shells and... Oh man, and you can't spin jump on them so you gotta like dodge all the beefsteaks. Then you get hit anyways and you're like, ugh, and then you get hit by the blast. Ah, ah, whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that a mistake or a secret? Well, you don't, can't stay there or you'll get crushed, so I don't really know. Hey, I've got a cave. I don't know if, if I can cave this shell. Yes, I can, but... Oh, but I just get rid of them entirely. Well, that was a waste of at least a perfectly good hit that I could have used, because, uh, you know, I keep getting hit by everything here. This, well, it's a lot easier to dodge when you're small, but I mean... It's a blast, man. You know what, if I was smart, actually, all I'd do is, once I'm at this stage, you just spin jump over everything. It's like... It's, it's, <laughs> it's the easiest thing ever! I, I, I don't know why this was so... I don't know why I was making this look so impossible, when honestly, it's kind of silly and kind of easy. We, we got multiple choices here. We got, like... Left wing, we got a right wing, we got a center wing, which I suppose is the chest. But no, next time on Freedom Super Mario World, we're going in the star iceberg and go into the special world because, well, the game ends at the castle, so you kind of want to end at the castle, right? I mean, I, I don't think I'm being silly if I propose this. So next time, special world. This is Raukau, see y'all next time. <laughs>